What's up guys, I'm gonna be covering another real estate deal that I bought. Um, obviously I wouldn't be buying real estate right now and I'm much more bullish on cryptocurrency and real estate and cryptocurrency are very similar where uh, you obviously do much better if you time it correctly and get in in a down market instead of a up market. So let's go through this deal. Um, I bought this property, let's go through the um, history. So. Whoever bought it before me bought it in 2000 for 345. This was one of the best deals, and I think this was actually the last deal I bought in Orange County. So I stopped buying properties in 2013. I kind of regret it because obviously prices continued to go up. Um, I went to graduate school to get education, and that could have been a mistake. It might have been better for me to not go to graduate school. I did my uh, MBA at USC. It might have been better for me to just continue to save that money. It was 120 grand, and to uh, continue to buy properties. And for now, I'm gonna regret that I didn't wait on getting additional education. I know a lot of people there are like, "Oh, just go get you know your master's, go get this degree." But sometimes waiting and uh, pursuing other opportunities like your own business or doing cryptocurrency or real estate investments might be a better idea. Anyway, so I paid 410 about, let's just say, um, seven, no, uh, five years ago, five, six years ago. And now um, from 410, this deal is worth supposedly 860. So it doubled. And uh, obviously, I've been collecting rent and uh, not, a, not a bad investment for five years for it to double. Um, so what's important, like I said, is just the timing. And right now I have a decent tenant in there paying rent. Um, some of the issues that you're gonna run into when you're doing real estate investments is buying um, in bad areas. And uh, fortunately this area was a kind of an up and coming area. So I haven't really had issues with the tenant. Um, I'm definitely not collecting 3,600 in rent with the estimate is saying. Um, I've actually rented this out for four thousand four hundred, um, but yeah, this was my last deal, and I guess like my biggest regret is I didn't continue to buy more properties when the market was down. And hopefully, uh, this won't be with you guys in crypto. Uh, we did have a down market in cryptocurrencies, and I'll just bring up the charts. Um, so as you can see, it, we've started to recover. Um, but yeah, the main thing is I've been staying out of real estate. Yes, I've made a good amount of money and I have passive income, which really helps, but I think it's overpriced in this market. There's no way, um, at least in California, where I can buy properties and cash flow them, um, which means you know I collect more rent than the mortgage and you have to also just consider property tax, expenses, insurance, stuff like that. Um, so crypto just seems like a much more uh, attractive asset class. Um, and just going back to these properties, which I would recommend for anyone who's getting into real estate, is I was buying six bedroom houses and why would you do that? Um, it's really easy with today's uh, social media, you know, Facebook, the internet to find roommates. So um, I would highly recommend buying a property where in the beginning, if you're gonna get into real estate, I would actually live in the property and rent the rooms. So uh, even this property I actually did live in. <laughs> so I would move into one of the rooms and then I would start to rent all the rooms. And once the property was full, then I would move out. Um, obviously, if you get a portfolio of homes, it becomes way too time consuming. So, uh, but this is just a great way to start if you wanna kind of copy off me. I don't know if you need six bedrooms if you're getting a much better deal. And that's the only reason I went to six bedrooms because you know, I could have paid uh, maybe like 300 grand for like three bedrooms, but for 100 grand more, it just made a lot more sense. And I could collect a lot more rent to, to get a six bedroom place. And I would definitely consider doing the same thing. Um, so yeah, when you're looking for your first real estate deal, and like I said, hopefully you're not buying in this market, you're buying in another market, uh, I would highly recommend if you've never had the experience, live in the property, rent one of the rooms, and then slowly kind of go from there. And then, like I said, if you're buying a smaller unit or if you end up getting a couple of units, then it doesn't make sense as much to rent the room. It might be easier and just more efficient for your time to, uh, to just completely rent out the unit. Um, 
but that's all you know and we all obviously hit 10,000 subscribers which is awesome for this channel I'll continue to cover cryptocurrency uh, real estate I'm really interested in real estate and like I said in the future I do want to make uh, a crypto coin that I can raise money to buy uh, future make future real estate investments like this and hopefully uh, double everyone's money and uh, pay some sort of dividend from the uh, the rental income that we'll collect from the real estate investments and like I said I'm open to investing outside of California I have properties in Vegas and hopefully while I'm doing this if other people get into investments and uh, start uh, looking for partners I, you know, I partner to buy this building and most of my buildings I, uh, I have partnerships so uh, I think that partnerships are really important especially when you're first getting into the real estate game um, but let me know what you guys think I think I'm gonna do a couple more of these videos of me purchasing the property but then I'm gonna go over just like tips and stuff that I like issues I've had with each property just management and being an owner and dealing with tenants and I have a decent memory, <laughs> so I think I'll do that. I'll go through the rest of the properties I own and basically kind of uh, go over um, how I got them and uh, what I'm doing with them now. And uh, just leave comments. Just let me know what else you guys want to know about real estate. Um, like I said, the channel will stay primarily cryptocurrency uh, focused, but uh, I don't mind uh, you know answering questions and doing future videos to kind of help out people if they if you have questions about real estate and i'm just going to end it that i wouldn't buy any real estate right now i would wait for prices to come down and uh, i would be instead following the crypto market i feel like there's a lot of opportunity in cryptocurrencies i'd be wary of the stock market and i do feel like in the next year or two cash will be king because if there is a crash you want to be able to buy assets for cheap but let me know what you guys think of this video, if you want more stuff like this, or just stick to covering the news. Um, thank you very much for watching, and I will talk to you guys soon.